Mm -hmm. Well, we can keep the snowblowers safely stored away, Kevin. Yeah, that is right, because I don't foresee any big snowstorms for a while. Thanksgiving week might be a little bit um, active. It's still way too early to say uh, just exactly what could be on the way, but a bit of a pattern shift. But preceding that next week looks really nice. Now, we do have a system which has been hanging around, just meandering about southern Canada into the northern plains, this low pressure in this upper level energy and it's providing all the cloud cover we have in North Dakota. It's still too close to keep our skies mostly clear. When it moves out, we're finally going to see a bit of a shift here in our own weather. We need a strong westerly wind to scour out the low clouds, even a chance for fog like we did a couple of days ago. We're going to have that again here, and that means more sunshine over the next several days. It also means a warm up, but unfortunately the downside will be the gusty winds on Sunday. But for now, we got that canopy cloud cover scattered light floor from time to time like we've had all day today back edge of the clouds now now through eastern Montana and far western North Dakota we can really make out that milky white that would be the low clouds we have and with that a few flurries remain 34 right now in Minot and in Bismarck Dickinson just below freezing at 30 but 27 in Williston again more clearing here back where we have the 20s that clear sky allowing for some radiational cooling heat escaping into outer space that's why it's cooler there than where we have the blanket of clouds which actually keeps our temperatures a little bit milder still chilly of course with the wind but still above freezing for many areas northwest winds right now around 10 to 15 but light winds back into eastern Montana that shifts farther east here for tonight and don't expect a lot of wind for tomorrow we're actually going to have several hours overnight of light wind and then a light southeast wind tomorrow. Only 5, 10, maybe 15 miles per hour. A few snow showers here for this evening. Otherwise, wind definitely decreasing because we're switching directions. That always happens when we go from a northwest wind to a southeast. We'll have a period of several hours of light or calm conditions overnight. That could be conducive for some fog, but then that light wind really stays not very strong or fairly light all day long here, but more of a southeasterly direction around 5 to 10, maybe 15. Chilly weather again, but a little bit more sunshine. Shine, so we might see a maybe a couple degrees warmer here for our Friday compared to what we had for today. But I'm optimistic we won't have a completely sunny day, but more sunshine than today. Now a dry pattern here for the next seven days. Uh, stormy weather elsewhere for the southern plains, also for the west coast, but not so much for the central or the northern plains here. Limited moisture though with that westerly wind on Sunday does mean the beginnings of a warm up here. Again, a long stretch of 50s on the way Sunday, probably lasting through most of next week, but it's the following week. We know it's just it's too good to be true to last, right? Uh, big changes perhaps for Thanksgiving week, but just don't know yet exactly what's going to be playing out, but uh, could be stormy. We're going to be keeping an eye on that, but for the time being, we got temps tonight in the teens to the middle 20s with highs about like today, maybe a few degrees warmer if we see a little bit more sunshine, which hopefully we will. But again, the wind will also be less than today, not nearly as strong. Seven day forecast. It just looks great. All in all, if we could just hold this through Thanksgiving, wouldn't that be nice for travelers? Uh, don't think that's going to happen, but at least through most of next week, well above normal temperatures expected. At least if we don't get a huge snowstorm right before. Not, let's hope not. That could happen, but not next week. All right, thanks. Uh -huh. yeah.